What you're about to see is undoubtedly the best five shot group at a thousand yards I've ever possibly shot. Um, and I know it doesn't necessarily come across it when you watch the video, but I was pretty excited. But what I really wanted to emphasize in this video is that it pays to have mentors. It pays to hang around, to get to know, to learn from people that are better than you. And, and when people say, oh, you know, John, what can I do? You know, people on my Patreon all the time. Hey, what's the first thing I should work on? Or, hey, I'm having trouble. And I always tell people, you got to find somebody that you can relate with. And, and if that's me, that's great. If it's somebody else, that's great. And, you know, for me, it's Eric Cortina. He's definitely one of my mentors that I go to. And he's had a lot of great advice over the, the last couple of years. And, um, you know, I really, uh, you know, I mean, we all kind of make our own path, but I think when people can help you go down that path a little easier, it, it, it definitely helps. And, you know, it's no secret that there's been times where he said, hey, you know, you should kind of, you know, here's some steps that you should follow. And, you know, I'm pretty pigheaded sometimes and, and, uh, and I haven't always followed those. And, and he's really quick to call me out, which I appreciate. And, um, you know, I know he's got a different sense of humor to some people, but, uh, but I appreciate that he's always very direct and, and he doesn't really mince words. And I, and I try to be that person, but, um, you know, it doesn't always come across that way. So, you know, I just wanted to let people know that having somebody that you can trust and, and I trust what he says. It doesn't mean that everything he says is going to work, but it means that I'm going to try everything he tells me to do. And, and, and there might be things I incorporate my own way and, um, you know, maybe there's processes that, you know, physically I have trouble with that he doesn't. But, you know, listening and trying and understanding goes a long way in this sport and it, it helps you become a better shooter. So if you don't have somebody like that, you know, somebody that you can, uh, you know, really go to when you're down, that you can talk to when things are bad. And, um, you know, I'm fortunate that I've got three or four guys like that that are that are all way better shooters than me that, um, you know, that are just fantastic people who if I'm having a bad day, if I'm, if I'm struggling to get a barrel to shoot, if I, you know, and if things are going great, they're there too. I mean, that's, that's the other great part of it. And so you're going to watch this video and, um, you know, I wasn't super excited, uh, on the outside, but I can tell you inside I was shaking when you see what I did here. And the first thing I did was, was called Cortina. Um, you know, and it's, it's because I was so excited, you know, and I, I wanted to, tell him what I would, what I had done. So, uh, you know, anyway, I, I won't, I won't drag this on, but find people you can trust, listen to what they say, be willing to change your methods. You know, as, as I said, and, and learn from Eric and other people, um, you know, people don't want your opinion. They want their opinion out of your mouth. And, and if that's how you're approaching things, you're never going to get better. So be willing to accept that your way may not work. Uh, be willing to try things before going back to your way. And and when you try things, you have to try them wholeheartedly because if you try them going, well, I know it's not going to work, but I'm going to try it anyway, um, then, then you're not really giving it a chance. So um, find somebody, listen to them, try what they're doing, find out how to make it work for you or, in, you know, kind of incorporate it into your setup and see if it improves your success. So with that, here it goes. Uh, my best five shot group at a thousand yards ever. All right, before we get started, just something to know. All 10 shots are the exact same powder charge. Shots one through five are bullets that have been sorted by one method that I'm testing, and shots six through 10 were sorted using a different method. So that being said, let's see what happened. E, 52.1.
1.68. For what? I just shot a five shot 1.68 inch group. You did what? I like it. Well, that might be what we take to the match next week. Here's the actual target, and you can see, I mean, more or less, it's it's right there. I think it measured 168 something, and the holes have been pushed a little bit, but it's pretty much right there. And uh, I accidentally circled in this shot, but there's two that you can see on the shot marker, and you can just barely see there's two here, but there's one, two, three, four, and five, and that's that group right there, so. There's the actual paper version of that.